popcorn, hon. Thanks. Well, that took a long time. Oh, yes, it did. Yes, it did. That line was so long. It was literally like I lived in Kosovo, and I'm waiting on a line for a little tiny piece of bread. Literally. I know what you mean, because you were gone so long, it was like you were gone a week. Yeah. I mean, literally. It was yeah. like you left on a Monday, and now it's Monday again, but a week later. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, okay. That man just bumped into me so hard that I think he literally impregnated me. <laughs> that literally qualifies as my first gay experience. Yeah, literally. literally. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi. Hi. I'm Bobby's mom. It's a big game for the boys, okay, huh? Okay, okay. That woman is literally sitting so close to me, it is like she has a job, and she is paid by how many inches her thighs overlap onto mine. Like, literally. Uh, I consider you lucky, because the gentleman to my right has what I would call a rancid odor. Yeah. It is like somebody literally switched his face with his ass. <laughs> Bleachers is an unqualified nightmare. I would literally rather be sitting in a pile of burning diapers. Literally. And I literally think I know someone who already is. <laughs> okay, you know what? Fine. All right, I'll move over, give you a little room. Yeah, me too. Are you happy? Judith? Yes, Clyde. That was possibly the most condescending statement I have ever heard. Mm -hmm. They're just like the two of them just spoke to us as if we were a pair of small, retarded ferrets. Yes. Literally. Literally. <laughs> Literally. I, I mean, their attitude is worse than a gay man's party when they've run out of ice. <laughs> Which, as everyone knows, is a lot of attitude. Let's go, Timmy. G-Rack one! Come on, let it go. Come on, hit it out of the park. Okay, somebody should literally hit Timmy out of the park. Oh, oh. <laughs> literally. Literally. Back to... Clearly, this game is a debacle. I mean, they, they literally would have been better off replacing the entire lineup with the cast of 60 Minutes. <laughs> and that cast is uncommonly old. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, I know. When I watch 60 Minutes, I am literally watching Mike Wallace decay into a skeleton in front of my eyes. Yes. Literally. 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 Uh, okay, see, right there? Mm -hmm. Right there, Timmy? Mm -hmm. Literally, right there. Just now, Timmy? Literally? Just now, qualified for the Special Olympics. <laughs> like, why did the coach even put him in the game? Uh, I'll, I'll tell you why, because clearly the coach is an Idiot! All right. You know, I've had about enough of you two. Yeah, how about we see how your perfect little children do? Oh, we don't have any kids. <laughs> we come here for the love of the game. Yes, yes, yes. Baseballs literally give me more pleasure than a couple of other balls that I'm intimately acquainted with. <laughs> literally. 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 You know, sitting here, listening to you talk is literally like having a root canal. It is literally like I, I'm in Nicaragua and I'm receiving a root canal with no novocaine from an uncredited Nicaraguan dentist. And he's sawing at my gums slowly with a rusty old nail. Digging. Literally. Okay. <laughs> literally. You literally Your Spanish need to accent is seriously reconsider the fact that you may not even be as human. Crazy. You may be the son of a turtle and a fish.